So here we have the new uh, ThinkPad X1 Carbon Gen 5. So this is with the fastest Intel. Absolutely, brand new Intel drives. For this year, what we've done with this ThinkPad X1 Carbon, we've made it thinner and lighter than ever. So this will be the thinnest and lightest commercial notebook available in the world. First time um, you do silver. First time we do silver, right? So a uh, brand new color for this year. Um, if we walk around the ports, we've got two USB Type-C Thunderbolt ports. So uh, um, two of them. So that means you can have very fast uh, Thunderbolt stuff going on? Absolutely. And every uh, USB Type-C adapter is going to work? Every USB Type-C adapter is going to work. We've also added anti-fry protection to protect against third-party USB Type-C devices as well. So if we go out and ask for 12 volts, listen to this 20, we'll throttle that down and make it's sure gonna we break the laptop. we're not going to break the laptop. And you have with, uh, two with that colors, we, you have the black one. Black one. Yep. Yeah. Can you show more ports? Yeah, so we also have two USB Type-A ports as well. So you get four USB ports total, USB Type-C and USB Type-A, HDMI port as well. We have a mini RJ45, lets you get native RJ45 or Ethernet to the system. So that's mini RJ45. You need an adapter. You need an adapter, but I can get native RJ45 to the system. Native. Native. Is that better than having a RJ45 or USB Type-C? It is. Because if you were trying to provision a system, uh, you would get the MAC address of the dongle, not the MAC address of the network. It's perfect. Interesting. So, so uh, this is a special dongle you have right there for gigabit. Yes, exactly. Not faster than gigabit, no? Huh? Not faster than gigabit. You're not going 2.5 gig or right, right, 10 gig right, right. or anything. Not right. yet. Okay. What are we looking at here? So we got our another USB Type A port over here. Our fan assembly, and we still have a headphone jack, even though we're really small. So, uh, how does it compare to the previous ThinkPad X1 carbon? It's so we're about a quarter of a pound lighter. We're about a few millimeters thinner, so we're under 60 millimeters now. Um, and this right here, we had to change our entire manufacturing process, the process that we use to make our carbon fiber top covers. We modified that completely to fit our camera above the display. So even though we have narrow bezel technology, we didn't move the camera below the display. You didn't do the XPS 13 mistake, right? We put the camera above the display. So a very thin bezel, 14 inch still. 14 Why do you still. have 14? 14 is a good sweet spot for the commercial market. So we find that uh, 14 allows us to get a full-size keyboard on the device. So uh, how about this keyboard? Is it the best keyboard in the world? It's always been the ThinkPad? ThinkPad really, really is defined by their keyboard. So people love our keyboards, the travel, the feel, the experience, and this one's no different. How, how does it work? Uh, how, how can it be the best? What's uh, the shapes are like? The shape of the keys are made such that um, you have fast, accurate typing. Also, the keyboard travels. So as you type, you know exactly which key is being pressed. So uh, the look and feel, the ergonomics of the keyboard, very, very serious with our user experience. Did team. you change anything in how the mousepad is uh, sensitive or? We did actually. So we made our uh, mouse pads a little bit bigger. We also will have Microsoft's Precision Touchpad and all ThinkPads for 2017. Right. And so what's the price? This one starts at $13.49. $13.49? How soon available? Available in March, beginning of March. March. And uh, there's also a uh, high resolution uh, WQHD display. That'll be coming soon, yes. And that's very expensive or no? It's uh, it's it's a little bit more expensive than our FHD. And how about the battery life? It gone up. Battery life has gone up. So we have a 52 watt hour battery in this device. So Mobile Mark 14 scores of up to 15 and a half hours. There it is, the Gen 5. Uh, a lot of businesses are using X1 Carbon. Very happy, right? Absolutely. They just give one to every employee. Not a lot of businesses are doing that. We're we're seeing more executive C-suite guys that are able to get the X1 Carbon devices. And uh, so basically it's the best laptop in the world, right? Best laptop in the world.